What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back and in today's video we are going to be continuing the Ranger. We're up to level 40. So I did a rough mock-up of what is to come in the future of this week here. And so I'm hoping that by Monday, which is Labor Day in the U.S., I will have a Ranger kind of build video. Hopefully, maybe by then, uh, I'll have that. I mocked up a bunch of different stuff. I also came up with my stream schedule. So I will go into more detail on that in the future. Tuesday, the day after Labor Day, which is, what is that? The 3rd? Because the 5th is Thursday? Yeah, the 3rd. The 3rd of September at, um, we'll go with 9 a.m. Eastern right now is the expected. I'll talk about it later at a different time um, and go over exactly when it'll be. But sometime in the near future, I will be having that stream on Tuesday. And it will be in the morning at some point because that just works out the best for me. Uh, and so I expect to be live by 10 at the latest and that will be on YouTube that'll be the one YouTube stream and what I'll do is I'll talk about some stuff that uh, I need to talk about before we eventually uh, move over to twitch for the next stream but I thought I would do that that'll give everybody who watches my YouTube videos a little bit of a preview of how streams would go on YouTube or on twitch if you Come over there and you subscribe to, or follow on twitch and watch my streams so i wanted to do one on youtube just for the sake of that to let everybody kind of know how it's gonna go and all of that different stuff so that's kind of how it is and that's what we'll do i'll have an official start time for in a later video uh coming up this week and once i nail down the exact time that i want to do it i will i will mention it at the beginning of every video what time we're going to be doing the stream so you'll know even if you don't watch every video so you'll be able to you'll be able to find out because i'll definitely want to mention it at the beginning of the noobs guide because that's the videos that uh the most people are watching right now where is this taking me it's taking me to sonals but where is sonals in relationship to where i am there's sonals to kill all over here but okay it's taking us over there to sonals camp I went ahead and bought better gear. I don't think I talked about this. So we bought the Bears Longbow plus 15, Parrying Dagger plus 7 because there was no other daggers up right now that were good enough. We also picked up this Chimera Pupil Gem. Uh, so we're going to put this on as soon as I stop running. And then I'm going to put this on over the binder. So that'll increase our AP. We're not working with too crazy of anything right now. Just 75-70, which, you know, is not very good i can barely kill these things i'd love to be able to kill them in like one shot but that's just not happening right now and i don't really like the skills so far that we have but it's all right it's it, it gets it gets the job done and in theme of the ranger which this video is obviously uh the stream will be on the archer so i will be playing on my archer getting it to 57 um that'll probably be most of the stream is just me getting the archer to 57 by farming either bashims or probably bashims could be something different but i'm gonna guess i do bashims Maybe, maybe Abandoned Iron Mine. I can't remember if Abandoned Iron Mine works to get you to 57, or if at 56 it just drops off. I don't remember. I don't quite remember. But I, uh, I definitely need to figure out some skills for this character. I did buy some, but we have a whole bunch of skill points that I'll show here after I kill this guy. Let me run up here to this hill. Oh, look at all the enemies over here. Look at all of those yellow dots on my map. It's kind of crazy. Okay. So looking at our skills, these are the ones that we can learn right now. Um, I think I want to pick up Razor Wind 1 or 2 and 3. Ooh, we can also get Razor Wind 4. That's kind of expensive, but uh, I, I got to I gotta find something to do. I've been using Will of Wind, Will of the Wind a little bit. It's kind of expensive to buy, but I'm going to get that up to 4. Penetrating Wind. Uh, haven't taken too much a look at that or descending current um you do that while mounted so i don't really 
use that all that much. Um, I think you have to put that on the skill wheel. Um, there's a bunch of these flow ones that I just don't think I would ever do. So I just don't use them. Uh, and so it's kind of a weird area that we're at right now because there's just not a lot of skills that I like. Now, this, this skill is still one of my favorites. But it's kind of slow and it doesn't get the job done like I would like it to. And this skill, I really like this skill, but it it actually is killing now. Before it wasn't one-shotting stuff, and so it was like really bad. It was like three-shotting stuff, and so I was like, well, this is a useless skill. But that's actually, if it's going to do that, that's actually kind of worth it. If it's going to not, if it's going to do enough damage to kill guys, or at least weaken them so they're one bow shot away, I can live with that to mix in a skill. But you can see we're, we're on a little bit of the struggle uh, AP-wise. I don't really care about my DP. I got pretty good. I'm pretty good at knowing and paying attention to my health and healing when I have to. But it's kind of the other stuff, like um, being able to damage stuff that's more important to me. That's why I always, when people ask me, I always suggest AP over DP at the beginning of the game. Eventually, your DP is going to just be higher than your AP. That's just how it's going to work. There's, there's not going to be like a little like, oh, which one do I want higher? Your DP is just going to get there eventually. And then for a while, then you'll catch your AP back up. But your DP is going to get higher because it's easier to get. It's easier to get high ranking um, AP gear than it is to get high ranking DP gear in the mid game. Which is what I would consider my Sork. You guys saw that yesterday's video. Uh, I showed most of the stuff on my Sork. So you guys got to see that. But point is, is that um, it's much easier to get mid tier gear that's like try gear i don't know if try is really mid game it's not end game gear but it's like late mid game i guess i would say <clears throat> like late late mid game and or mid game ends really when you start on like i would say like try boss gear when you have like all try bar boss gear i think you're you're done with the mid game now you're in like early stages of the end game i don't know if that makes sense i think it makes sense but it probably changed it. I would say you're at the end game of the X. Oh my gosh, what just absolutely destroyed my soul? I have aliens tears, so I'll just get back up. Is there a stronger enemy here? I don't know. No, I don't know. I just got my. I got absolutely rocked. As I talk about not caring about. What am I getting hit by? What is hitting me over there? Coming back over here. Coming back to the safety of whatever's over here, because over there was a nightmare. There is a really strong enemy up here that I don't really want to tangle with. Because my... I do not have... do not have enough <laughs> AP to fight strong stuff. I tried to fight strong stuff at the last area before I came here. And that's just... That's a no bueno situation. That's just a terrible, terrible idea. I just gotta... I'm used to having, like, really good stuff at this point. Because... I just transfer my archer gear over to other characters on Xbox, and or my my sorceress gear over to my other characters on Xbox, and I don't have to worry. But on here, I do have to worry, and that's the tragic part of this. Is that I just don't quite... Can I get out of this animation? Okay. Stop hitting me. Who is hitting me? Don't knock me out of this. Let me, let me accept the quest. Oh, we're on a boss. Nice. And there are a ton of black spirit gifts that I haven't been redeeming. Summon you, so I... Oh my gosh, what is hitting... I don't get what's hitting me here. Is, it in, is there someone in the archer tower? I don't even see anybody up there. Hey buddy, you gotta die so I can summon the black spirit. Bring out the black spirit. But yeah, I'm hoping to get this character towards end game. Uh, I gotta go this way. By the end of this week. Not end game, but towards the end game of what we have on PlayStation. So 55, 56. I want to get her to 56 so that I don't have to do what I did on my Sorceress. And when Awakenings drop, have to level her to 56. I want to get her there on her own. So probably my first... No, I'll probably get her to 56 on my own before I would do my second stream. Because I think next week um, it'll be stream Tuesday and then stream Thursday. 
so I'll have... I have a stream schedule I think that's going to work for me. Uh, I do have, like, college... Uh, I have to actually go and drive to college two days a week. So I do have, like, that. But I also have a part-time job. I think I talked about it before as a cashier... Or as a office administrator at a grocery store. So I do have, like, that stuff. So it kind of interferes a little bit with me doing this. Uh, but I, my plan is to stream, like, three days a week. Three days a week for now, and then maybe we'll ramp it up later. Um, my work is real flexible with me. If I want to cut back... Right now, I work three days a week. If I wanted to cut back to two or whatever, uh, which I'm already thinking about doing for school. Um, so, yeah. I might end up cutting back to three, which or to two, which would make it really easy to... do some of the... Some more streams, I guess. Okay, you hit really hard. Get on, get unstuck, please. Okay, we got, we got to do some dodging maneuvers. Do some dodging maneuvers and heal. Gotta, gotta keep dodging, cause my DP, I guess, is not strong enough to fight the Sonal Siege Captain. It's been a really, the next character that comes out on Xbox. Holy crap! Back up, back up, back up, back up. The next character that comes out on Xbox, I will definitely be doing um, the storyline on it, and we'll have some fun with that, because I for they must have changed up the areas. Maybe? Maybe I'm just not remembering it, because it's been a while since I did the main story only. Um, they take you to a lot of areas that I'm not used to going to, because when you do the one where you just fight enemies, they take you to completely different areas, and when you side with Isabella in Karosha where there's less cutscenes, you go to completely different areas, too. Like, it's been a really long time since I fought the Sonal Siege Captain, because I didn't fight it on my Sork, because I did, I sided with Isabel. I fought it on my Witch, I believe, or maybe I didn't even fight it at all, but it's been a really long time, so I definitely, whenever the next character, whether it's Tamer or Valkyrie or whoever's next for Xbox, I will definitely be uh, doing the main story. And spending a lot of time doing the main story. Because I've actually really enjoyed this. Uh, I know I haven't been showing... I, I stopped showing everything. But I still have really been enjoying playing through this. Just based on the enemies that you get to fight. And all of that different stuff. Now what I like to have... Um, I feel like you level up a little bit slower doing this. Uh, I should probably be farming slightly more than I am. But... But I, uh, am having a lot more fun with this than just slaughtering enemy after enemy after enemy. Because this is, like, different areas that I never go to. Because, like, these beginning areas, I don't come back to them. There's not a point to. Like, I'm not going to come to the Sonal camp on my Sork. It just doesn't make any sense. There, I would one-shot everything and get zero XP for it. So there's, like, no point. So I kind of can create my own fun by playing through differently every time I play. And so then I can go to different areas, which is really nice. I went to an area yesterday that I had never gone to before. Uh, when I was getting this to 40 to do this episode, I went to, like, a brand new area. And I was, like, shocked because I was, I was like, I thought I had explored every area, but I guess not. One of these days I'm going to have, like, a, a just an exploration episode on my Sork. I don't really care about discovering 100% of the map on this because... PlayStation is just for fun. I'm not taking PlayStation serious. I don't care if my gear is not the best on PlayStation. I'll probably have Black Abyssal on PlayStation for a long time before I get, like, try Kazarka's bow or whatever. But point is, is that on Xbox, I do want to discover everything. That's kind of my... That's my serious console, if that's what you want to call it. Discovered Sonal's camp, even though I think I already discovered it. Okay, cutscene. of your final wish is nigh. Yes, it is time. Those wretched Calfionian scum will meet their end here. <laughs> you are mistaken. What do you mean? If we destroy this place, the Calfionian troops will be doomed, and I will finally be king. <laughs> Ignorant fool, I will make you a king. The king of worms, that is. 
So you were absorbing other human souls, waiting for the chance to take possession of my body. Your soul was full of the purest form of anger. That is why I chose you. But now it is broken, and it reeks of weakness. Uh, Belmorn, you filthy scum! Kanarak, Kentri, Penoa. Uh, yeah, so it's definitely been way too long because I don't remember that at all. So I don't want to do that. Where is the main story, dude? Trina Scout. Night Scout. Okay, what is our next quest? Black Spirit, what is it? The final battle. Really, this is it. Recommended level is 45. Use the Origin of Light and defeat Belmore. This is this really the final battle for this? For 45, really. We're, we're 45. That's what it suggests. Well, let's slaughter what we can on our way over to that boss fight. And then we'll attempt it, and if I get absolutely destroyed, I will, uh... <laughs> I will level up, and we'll kill it in the next episode. Getting a lot of black stones, which is really nice. And I think we can level up a fair amount before we get there. I'm hoping. Maybe to... We can definitely get 43. Do I have any extra bonus... Um, XP, uh, scrolls. I don't. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. I'm gonna eat this food to get it out of my inventory. I'll eat the fish as well. Get that out of my inventory. Okay, well, let's just, uh, slaughter these guys on our way over and, uh, we'll see how this goes. I'm probably going to get absolutely destroyed. But maybe the plus 15 weapon will carry me. I'm slightly worried about my health. That's what I'm really worried about. Because while my DP, I don't care about my DP. I don't like my DP to just be straight garbage, which is what it is right now. It's straight trash. Ooh, ancient relic crystal. Nice. That probably has some decent value on, uh, on PlayStation right now. It has a fair value on Xbox. So I would assume it's got some good value on, uh, on PlayStation. But I could be, I could be wrong. Let me see if I can check it real quick. Uh, I don't know, only 446. It's like a mil, it was like a mil on Xbox, like 700,000 on Xbox, so that's interesting. Where is this final battle? <laughs> if it's super far away, then I don't know why. Oh no, it's not super far away. Okay, we'll just run there and I'll kill stuff and we'll, we'll give it a go. Like I said, if I get absolutely destroyed, we'll end the episode, and then we'll go from there in the next episode. Because I, uh, I probably don't have time to record it today. Or to, like, to, like, cut, go through, record it, and then get this video out at a reasonable time. So, we'll just upload it in a day. I think, I think tomorrow is just Noob's Guide video. And so it would be Thursday. We can't defeat it. It'll be Thursday. But hopefully we can. We can. Hopefully we're good enough. We don't get absolutely destroyed. I'm worried about getting, like, one shot. I think I'm going to end up getting, like, one shot by it. Which is not what I want to have happen. At all. I have 27 minutes of moving faster. That is that what the fried fish gives me? Is movement speed? I don't think I've ever... I never eat my fried fish. I never look at it, obviously. 
Is that what it does? Oh, yeah, it does. Movement, well, movement speed plus one for 30 minutes. Interesting. Did not know that. Is it really in the cave? Oh, I need to use the... Okay, here we go. Okay, well, let's try it. There wasn't a whole lot for me to... Oh, it's just... Okay. I thought I had to fight the dragon. The drag... Or the whatever that is. That's not really a dragon. But I wanted to fight that thing, not... This... Where are you going, buddy? Okay, I don't think I can hit him. I don't think I can hit him. Okay, run into the cave. I think I'm supposed to go to that, like light thing i don't actually know isn't there like a light source thing in here isn't it down here it says use the origin of light does that just mean i use the origin of light see look at the origin of clear water does this mean anything okay well i don't think i think i just have to get absolutely destroyed by this guy all right, I'm coming back, buddy. Let's party. Where did you go? I thought I had to go do that, but I'm just stupid. Like, I literally don't remember this at all, but where is he? Or did it de- I think- Oh, no, it didn't despawn him. Okay, buddy, let's party. I deal no damage. There we go. Now I'm dealing damage. Aha! Oh gosh, move! Move! Oh my gosh, he does so much damage. Okay, I just have to play the smart. I think I can beat him. If I just play the smart, jump back. Don't be stupid. I just can't afford to get hit like twice in a row. I have to keep on the move. Okay, I gotta get these guys out of here. And they're blue, which is which is never a good sign when they're blue. Oh my gosh, you called in the dragon? Chill, buddy. Chill. They don't deal. His friends don't deal a whole lot of damage. He does a lot of damage, but they don't. And what? Do you just keep spawning these things? Chill out. Oh my gosh, this is it's gonna be a nightmare and a half. If I do this, this will be like the greatest feat ever in Black Desert for me. And somehow he just hit me and did no damage. Hey, chill. I need to kill your stupid wizards. How did I dodge that? I I'm kind of cheesing here with the dodging, but... These things are, like, super strong in comparison to me. And without knowing his health, I don't want to get... I don't want to get, like, complacent. Like, I assume he's still relatively full. I just cancel my own attack by accident there. And with that, I'm trying to take out these last remaining wizards. Done with that. Okay. Let's go over here and get this wizard out of the way. Wizard? Really? You're gonna run away from me like that? Stop it. And he summoned more. Okay, I see how this is gonna go. Go, move, move. There's so many. Oh my gosh, there's so. Why is there so many of them? Chill, chill, buddy. Why do you have? Oh my gosh, summon like a an army. Oh, the victory. Okay, that was way easier than I ever thought it would be. That was like that was like really easy. I'm not gonna lie. That was like too easy. That's, like, a challenging thing, but that's, like, really easy to do, I guess. That's Relic of Trina Beacon Towers. Okay, so we need to find out more about the relics at the Trina Beacon Mounds. Okay, well, that was, uh, that was an interesting boss fight, and uh, I think that's probably a good place to call it for this episode. I'm gonna progress some more, uh, see if I can maybe get myself some better gear, because my gear is straight cheeks. So I'm hoping, hoping that uh, eventually here I'll be able to get myself a parrying dagger that's plus 15, but not looking good right now. Uh, the bronze dagger is really not what I want, but uh, if one of those popped up at plus 15, I wouldn't say no to that. 
I uh, probably need to start working on some accessories. We need to get two Asulas. That would really help. Um, but we're still a ways away from that because Asula is obviously over here at Helm's Post, Elric Shrine, and Abandoned Iron Mine. I just need to get to Abandoned Iron Mine, let's be honest. I just gotta get to, I gotta get to my home where I feel comfortable and warm inside. I want, I want to go to, El to Abandoned Iron Mine. It's my favorite place in the whole entire game at this point. I really like that. I really like... So if I had to rank my top five favorite areas, it would be Abandoned Iron Mine, Catfishman, uh, Desert, Nagas. This is of areas I've gone to, okay? It has to have a good mix of enemies that I like. It has to be good farm and all of that. I don't really like Thousands just because it's Thousands. Everybody goes to Thousands. I don't really like Thousands, but uh, yeah. Catfishman, uh, Bloody Monastery... Uh, Abandoned Iron Mine. Uh, what else is there? Bashims and uh, Desert Desert Nagas. I haven't gone to Desert Foggins yet, so I can't honestly say if I like Desert Foggins more or less. But uh, that's going to do it for this video, guys. I don't think I need to go on anymore and show you guys anything else today. In the next episode, hopefully I'm level 50, maybe 50. Um, and we will be doing some more stuff uh when I hit level 50, then we'll, once we get to Abandoned Iron Mine, I'm going to farm Abandoned Iron Mine for like an hour and see what I can get and then go from there. Um, because I want to get a Sula set as soon as possible. So farming there is my, has been my best luck on Xbox to get a Sula set. So that's why I'm going to farm there as well as it's been one of my favorite experience spots. So it's kind of a, it's uh, it's killing two birds with one stone on on PlayStation here. So that's what I'm going to do. But uh, as always, I'm going to stop blabbling on. If this is a cutscene, we'll watch the cutscene, and then I will call it a video because it's going to be a cutscene. Morn is gone. Everything he did was in vain. Oh, you may despise me, but I shall never apologize. I don't consider anything I've done to be a mistake, and I am still far from finished. Victory shall be mine. Okay, that was that was pretty cool. I definitely. 100% promise you, the next character that comes out for Xbox, it will be a full story playthrough. I'm going to take the story seriously. We're going to do episodes simply based on the story and leveling. 
And uh, I think it'll be really fun. We're just waiting for that to happen. Uh, should be sometime in September. We should get it soon. Uh, but here is Kaya Necklace. You can see clearly way better than uh, our current Eagle's Talon Necklace. Uh, Terra Terratas Armor. Um, we'll sell that piece of gear. And then I'll look to try to see if I can sell any of this other stuff. But uh, that's going to do it, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. Drop it a big old like if you did. Subscribe if you have not. Uh, I hadn't been saying that, so I've got to remember my old my my phrase to end every video. Catch you guys later. Peace. Cause when it's all over.